uh, no telling when I'll be able to go back to my home. Developing tonight, two weeks after a natural gas leak, residents in a Georgetown neighborhood are still displaced. Atmos Energy officials say the leak is fixed, but crews are working to get rid of all of the gas that leaked out. CBS Austin's Christian Flores joins us live from Georgetown tonight, and Christian neighbors are frustrated here. Yeah, they are because they don't know when they can get back into their homes. Atmos Energy officials say the problem is the gas is trapped in the soil and you can see crews have marked where they have checked the soil. But one displaced neighbor tells me workers out here are telling him a different story. A spark it could ignite them. That's the worry for Georgetown neighbors in the Riverbend Drive area. After a natural gas leak that began February 20th has forced many into hotels. Robert Dole Bear is one neighbor worried one small mistake could turn him homeless. A zero indicator is ideal and anything at a 10 or more is explosive uh, levels. And at one corner of my house, they registered a 10, and at another corner, they registered an 11. And so apparently this is seeping out of the ground. Currently, 61 businesses and 30 homes have been evacuated, up from 26 homes yesterday. Atmos Energy officials say the evacuations are a precaution. The leak has been fixed, and they're working to remove residual gas trapped in the soil. But Dole Bear says he's hearing differently from crews on site. What they're telling me is, is that they are no closer to finding the leak than when they started. They're not sure where it's come from, and they don't know how long it's going to take. Atmos has placed evacuated neighbors in hotels, but Dole Bear says they did not book him for long enough, and he's being forced to move, which has proven to be problematic. And I got called back and was told that they're having trouble finding a place that's pet friendly and finding a place for us long term due to the South by Southwest conference that's coming up. As crews continue to work, Dole Bear says he will be uneasy when he's clear to return home. And even if we do get to return, I'm not sure if I feel safe going back to it. And at most energy officials have not yet said when the evacuation orders will be lifted, but they're going to continue to work with the community. Reporting live in Georgetown, Christian Flores, CBS Austin.